Well, hello, this is Michelino again. Yes, coffee addict, our friend from Denmark was right. I went to Madrid to spend the weekend with favorite Mr. B. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your worst nightmare come true. This is Picture Night with Michelino. What I liked about Madrid, well, the architecture, first of all, as you can see, some uh, very interesting contrasts of different architecture styles. I'm very interested in architecture, although as you can hear, I don't know at all any of the uh, terminology that goes together with it. Um, this one looks very much like a m more modern New York skyscraper. This is the Puerta del Sol, uh, where all these madrileños, the inhabitants of Madrid, get together on New Year's Eve and uh, drink champagne uh, at the foot of this building with the typical neon sign. You get to see these uh, really colorful, it goes from very colorful to very uh, dark uh, or glitzy uh, facade. The Plaza Mayor uh, that we've just seen now uh, was a bit of a disappointment. Um, not very ornate, not necessarily very interesting. This is favorite Mr. B posing in front of El Gato Negro. And this is me taking pictures of all the phallic symbols I could find in the city. There weren't many, unfortunately. And now we are at the Atocha train station. Um, one of the most beautiful iron structures I've ever seen in my life. Um, this is actually the place where the bombings took place in 2003, killing more than 200 people. Uh, it's also a place where um, a tropical garden was uh, was created, and you can see me there in front of the tropical garden. You can see the steam coming out of the place, which makes the whole place really humid. Um, it really feels like you're down in Thailand somewhere. Um, even the turtles that um, inhabit inhabit the um, the pond um, feel happy there. This these were some stupid boring pictures of a wedding that took place outside. And this is my favorite part: food. Yes, look at these smoked hams hanging there, tempting me. Oh, I love them. They're gorgeous, and so is he. Look at him looking all perplexed at these smoked hams. So in order to d enjoy the food, we had to ask a local. So we asked actually my colleague who works for the company where I work, but at the Madrid office, and she took us to this weird restaurant with experimental food. You can see here, favorite Mr. B looking all puzzled by the food. This is an attempt uh, for me to take the pic a picture of my food. Well, anyway, this was the next day. This was much better. Um, this is the tapas with anchovy, delicious anchovy um, um, bocadillos. Mm, gosh, they were good. Okay, religion is widespread through Madrid, which is quite surprising for Europe nowadays. You see these weird symbols like cathedrals. Like, hello, what is that? We got in the cathedral. It was mass time actually you see the beautiful tainted glasses up there um, I think it was a bit high in there uh, don't you think these looks like fancy drinks and oh my god I see dead people these people actually their souls are coming out of them it's crazy it's out of control oh and so is she out of control mother superior flying in the air oh gosh it looks like they were all high in there this is the Royal Palace right near the cathedral where we've just been. Um, this is a picture that my grandmother would have liked uh, of the Royal Castle in a golden frame. There was a beautiful classical concert right outside the, the Royal Palace with this um, conductor uh, doing the spread eagle. Um, favorite Mr. B looking all cute and passionate about this classical concert and right next door this cannabis libre uh, demonstration free um, weed for everyone um, I told you about contrast well that's one this is me looking all sissy smoking cannabis in front of the royal palace and uh, oops this is me l forgetting that actually we came here to Madrid to visit museums you can see the angst in my eyes we have to run and hurry up on the way we saw that funky little man with a hat that looks like a dog plate uh, we'd never really understood what he was doing there 
Um, we took the metro, which is nicely organized, actually, at the Puerta del Sol. Uh, very clean. And we got to the Tyson's wonderful art gallery. We couldn't take pictures, unfortunately, in there. So we went to the Reina Sofia, where the famous Guernica, beautiful uh, 1937 painting. This is The Accident by Ponte de Leon. And uh, this is the uh, Spanish dancer, which is quite obvious, don't you think? This is actually the German lady, beautiful German lady. That's the name of the piece of art. Um, you can see some more cubist art. Who's this famous painting who's painted the great masturbator, as it's called? The same painter has created this one. This is actually the daughter of the painter. This was a mix between um, Dali and um, another uh, famous photographer, especially. Can you guess who that was? And who is that? Hmm. A French artist whose favorite color is blue. And this is me. With all the, picked, with all the cigarettes I've bought, this is what I'm going to look like. And this is the end of our little documentary about Madrid. And we're saying goodbye and thank you for watching.